Hello everyone, welcome to Learn Flutter for Beginners series. Today I'll be showing how you can install Flutter on Ubuntu or Linux operating system. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Let me open a browser window first. And then search for Flutter. Then click on the Flutter dev link. On this page, click on get started. Then click on Linux. Here you can see the system requirements. The latest version of Ubuntu satisfies most of them, except a few ones. So we'll quickly install them one by one. Let me open a terminal window. And type in sudo apt install curl. And then press enter. Type in your password. Then we will install git. So type in sudo apt install git. And press enter. Enter again. Let me go back to the browser. Next we'll install the Flutter SDK. You can install it using the terminal or you can also download the tar file. Just click on the big blue button. It will take some time so I'll come back when the download is finished. As you can see the file has been downloaded. Now I'll create a new folder in my documents. I will name it Flutter Dev. Now I will extract the file I just downloaded to this Flutter Dev folder. As you can see the extraction is done. Let me go back to the documents folder. Then I will go inside the Flutter dev folder and move the Flutter folder up so that the path becomes smaller. Then I will simply delete the empty folder. Now click on Flutter and then go inside the bin folder. Now I will go back to the browser. and copy the path directory then just open a new file manager window here click on the show hidden files option then open the bash rc file with a text editor scroll down and paste the path at the bottom of this file now i'll go back to the bin folder and click on properties Copy the path directory. And replace it in the bash rc file. Don't forget to add bin in the end. Then simply click on save and close the text editor. Now copy flutter precache and open a terminal window you have to restart the terminal or open a new terminal window since we have modified the bash rc file then type in flutter and press enter as you can see flutter is installed successfully so we'll just paste flutter precache and press enter let me clear the window and go back to the browser window scroll down next we'll install android studio so let me click on the android studio link on this page just click on download android studio then go through the terms and conditions then click on agree and then download android studio so it will go ahead and start downloading 
it will take some time so i'll come back when the download is finished as you can see android studio has been downloaded on my downloads folder now i'll extract it on the flutter dev folder So the file has been extracted. Let me go back to Flutter dev folder. Then I will move the Android Studio folder one folder up. And delete the empty folder. Let me click on Android Studio. And then go inside the bin folder. Now I will right click and click on open in terminal. Then I will type the studio.sh and press enter. It will open the Android Studio setup wizard. Let me close out everything. If you are running Android Studio for the first time, just click on OK. Then click on next. Here you can customize your install type but I will go with the standard one then select your preferred theme and click on next now verify the settings and click on next then accept the android SDK license agreement and click on next at last just click on finish so it will go ahead and download and install the components this will take some time I will come back when the installation is finished as you can see the installation is finished this is the android studio welcome screen welcome to android studio then i will click on more actions and then sdk manager make sure android sdk is selected on the left panel and then click on sdk tools then select the android sdk command line tools latest and click on apply click on ok it will go ahead and install the SDK component. So the SDK component has been installed. Just click on finish and then OK. Next we will click on plugins on the left menu and search for Flutter. Select it and click on install. Accept the third party privacy note. Flutter also requires Dart to be installed, so just click on install. Then we have to restart the IDE. So just click on it and then click on restart. As you can see, new Flutter project can be seen on the Welcome to Android Studio window. Let me close it and go back to the browser window. Here I will copy the Flutter Android Studio directory. And paste it inside a terminal. Then I will go back to the Android Studio bin folder. And click on properties. Then copy the path directory. and paste it in the terminal make sure that android studio is included in the path press enter and close the terminal window let's go back to the browser next we have to accept the android licenses so just copy this command and paste in a terminal window Type Y and press enter one by one to accept all the license agreement. Next we will update the additional Linux requirements. So just copy the last command. And paste it inside a terminal. Press enter and confirm with your password. Enter again since Y is selected by default. 
it will go ahead and download and install all the additional requirements you need for Flutter development on Ubuntu or Linux operating system. Let me clear the window. And then I will type in Flutter Doctor and press enter. As you can see, Flutter has been installed successfully on my Ubuntu machine. I have already installed Visual Studio Code on my system. If you do not have VS Code installed on your system, you can simply go ahead and install it. So in the end, there will be no issues to be found. That's it. This is how you install Flutter on Ubuntu or Linux. And as always, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, comment below. See you in the next one. Bye.